World Education Fair 2022, organized by Campus Direct, your trusted partner in education. Sri Lanka, Vanitha Bimana. The grand finale of Vanita Bimana 2021 was held at the BMIC yesterday to recognize Sri Lanka's female achievers on a national level. Competitions were held under 10 categories at provincial levels under this program organized by News First and NDB Bank over the past few months. NDB News First Opavetta Tilanakarana Sri Lanka Vanita Bimana Dedahas VC Eka. The provincial level winners then made it to the national level competitions during which a winner was chosen for each category. National level winners of the 10 categories were awarded at today's event. 10 women who have performed exceptionally well in their respective fields received the Vanita Bimana Award today. Among the top five were Pushpa Ramyani de Soiza, the national coordinator of the Colombo National Hospital, actress Shalani Taraka, singer Shashika Nisansala, singer Umaria Singhavansa, and singer Yohani de Silva. Umaria Singhavansa was adjudged the most popular woman in Sri Lanka. In addition to this, five Sri Lankan women received a Lifetime Achievement Award for their extraordinary service to the nation in their career. The recipients were veteran actress Malini Fonseca, veteran singer Dr. Sujata Attanayaka, Professor Malini Adagama, veteran author Anula De Silva and international civil servant Jayatma Vikramanayaka. The winners of the Vanita Bimana competitions were chosen by a panel of judges led by Anusha Gokula Fernando, the Director General of the Department of Manpower and Employment. All of you are aware that we had to face multiple challenges due to COVID-19. Many restrictions were in place, but during the last six months, NDB and News First undertook the challenge and remained committed to fulfill our duty and organize Vanita Bimana. Through Gammadha and Vanita Bimana, we've come to realize that the true power of this nation lives in our village, that the true potential of this nation lives amongst the young people, the Sri Lankan woman, who's toiling and leading day in and day out. And unfortunately, we can't possibly recognize all of them here today. And so there is a lot to be done. I think one of the most important facts of Vanita Bimana is to acknowledge the fact that we have done so little. Women have done so much for our nation, but we have done so little for them. And so while we celebrate International Women's Day today, what was special is the fact that two years ago we decided to commit ourselves to working every day towards the potential of the Sri Lankan woman. I am happy to say that the Vanita Bimana program is being conducted to fulfill a national requirement. In addition to that, NDB Bank is not supporting this endeavor by expecting any financial benefit. 
When we were trying to implement the concept of Vanita Bimana in the country, we identified that News First was the best media network to partner with. This is when we began the first phase of Vanita Bimana by partnering with News First in 2020. And today, we are witnessing the second phase. We are happy with the progress we have made.